Okay, the Daleks. Not Dalek, Daleks. An ex Dalek. It's the Norwegian blue of the Dalek world, perhaps. Um, yeah, this is this is an interesting thing. I um, I thought, what am I going to do a video on? And I've got loads of not Lego. Say hello to Walter again. Hello, Walter. Um, loads of not Lego, but I thought, no, I want to do something a little bit different. And I've got this, which um, <laughs> is just strange and shiny and I like strange and shiny so I actually got two of them the Daleks made in England measure I don't know if the box has much else on it so <laughs> got really detailed using instructions there using instructions that's not the right term is it it's got really detailed instructions for use um, what do we have on the box Daleks measures are also available with silver plated finish, including the interior of the measure, for use with wines, spirits and cordials. Not sure which one I've got. This, that must be chrome. That that looks quite chromey. Um, I have two, not only because I have two, but because um, I've misplaced some bits. Which will become apparent in a moment. There's a cork. There's no cork. I can't find the spare corks. But unfortunately, I can't get this one open. I, I'm afraid to break it. Whereas this one does. So you can see what it does on the inside, or what it does. Or what it does really is just, just that. It's a headless Dalek. That's why it's next Dalek. Um. So what is what is what is what is it? It's it's a thing that I can't get to screw back together. Mm, that's that. Ah, there we go. Yeah, it. I think these are from the 60s, and clearly the name is a cunning take on 1960s Doctor Who. Um, without paying Terry Nation vast sums of money, I would imagine, for the rights to slightly Dalek, or Daleks. Um, and it's it's just a thing, isn't it? I don't want to force this because it's already uh, cracking. Come on, camera. Come on, camera. Well, you probably can't see, but yeah, it's it's already cracking a little bit there on the one that's got the cork on it. I don't want to upset it further. <sighs> now, I'm doing a video about a pourer. What am I going to pour? You'll be really shocked to know. It's rum. It's the finest rum. It's the finest little rum. Quality knows no beginnings in this place. Actually, it's not bad rum for cheap rum. <laughs> and I usually only have one when I do a video. As you can see, I don't have many videos left to go before I have to top up the rum. Uh, the thing goes in like that. Should probably have used a fresh cork, but I don't have one. It sits like that and you pour. The other thing is I don't know how much it takes. So much as I'd normally use one of these fairly small glasses, I'm having to use a tumbler just in case. Not that sort of tumbler, that's a scary internet place. This is a drinks tumbler, which with a Dalek could be quite scary in itself. Uh, how do we get this so we can have the best chance of seeing what happens? Hmm, we probably don't. I have filled this with water to try and swirl it out a bit and got a vague idea as to how it works. This is the first time I've used it to pour a drink and it could be the first time since 1966 since it's been used to pour a drink. Let's see. Yeah. That is slightly more clever than I am because I think that um, I was a bit late in bringing the bottle back. Ooh. That's a bit of a travesty, late in bringing bottles back. Did you see, though? You tip the bottle, it goes glug, 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 and it pours a measure. I think that's very clever. And, uh, not at all Dalek-y. Well, maybe a bit dalek -y. I don't know. Do the Daleks drink rum? Do the Daleks drink at all? <sighs> Do Daleks just get their backstory rewritten whenever it suits the, the uh, story writers in Doctor Who? Uh, <sighs> will that fit? I'm... Mm. Should I even attempt it? I'm curious now. Will this measure of rum fit in? Oh, 
just 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 that is a little bit on the close side so actually the Daleks <laughs> must remember not to call it a Dalek the Daleks gives just about a perfect measure for a video that's quite handy to know isn't it anyway mm. oh, I hope to god that doesn't exterminate me